Hello there beautiful people, I hope you're doing well and welcome back again to On How channel. For people that don't know, my name is Anas, I'm working for you, so if you have any questions, any video requests, make sure to drop on below in a comment, I will be happy to make a video for you. And for people that do know, welcome back, you already know, you should be a witness to over 100 videos I made so far on Shopify customization, because they were mostly requested by you guys, I mean subscribers, some people not even subscribers, but I'm fine with that. Just a like button, that's all I'm asking. Or actually, if you are interested in Shopify customization, you want to be an expert to do anything without having to hire a developer, why not subscribe to the channel, man? I don't have anything to sell. I don't sell any courses, never will. I don't have any paid memberships. I don't have any paid uh, codes. Everything I do create, every content I do create, I post it completely free on the channel. You just have to skip around some advertisements, but that's the case most of the videos on YouTube, if not all of them, including the entertainment ones you like to watch, right? I don't make entertainment videos, I make value videos, which is the thing that will help you in your future and your career. But I'll let you decide and I respect your decision, just a like button, that's all I'm asking, if this video helped you out. And here I am again, back with another requested video, which is how to hide the out of stock or any available variants on your Shopify store. So if you have a variant that's not available anymore or out of stock, you can actually hide it. So it will be actually automatically, the code will automatically hide any variant that's out of stock. So you don't have to follow up and keep track which one uh, that's out of stock and which or not. This code will do that automatically. Once a product becomes out of stock, it will automatically disappear. It will not, sorry, I don't mean uh, product, it variant. Once a variant becomes out of stock, it will automatically be hidden and it will not show up on the product page anymore for that particular product. Without any more talking, let's just get to it. As you can see, this is the, this is the Shopify dashboard and I have here the down team, which is the one I do demonstrations on. So every video I do demonstration on down team because it's the most requested one and it's also the most used one. But if I scroll down in here, I have every other free teams. I mean the most used ones again, which is a refresh, spotlight, taste, sense, and trade. And if you are wondering why is that, because I do actually try the tricks behind the scenes on all of these teams. So again, if even if you're not using down team, you're using one of these, it should work for you just fine. Because I do try it behind the scenes and I, do do, I don't do that in the video, so I don't bore people. And I just have to say this in the beginning, so I give you that peace of mind. So you would know, you will see me doing it on down team. You might be thinking maybe it's not working for the others. No, it does. It is working just fine. And even if it didn't, just drop me a comment. I will be happy to help you out. And with that out of the way, let's just get to it and show you how to hide the out of stock or any available variants on your Shopify product page. And this is the Shopify uh, store I do all the tricks on. So every little thing you see on the Shopify store, I did it in tutorials. The shiny effect on the buttons, the announcement bar, moving text and a link on it, search bar, shadow effect with the rounded corners, every little thing. So if you saw anything on the Shopify store that you think it looks good and you want to implement it, just check out the channel. Once it's here on the store, that means that video is already done and it's already posted. So, uh, no worries. But what I'm talking about here, let's just access this product because I think I have some, yeah, this one. So as you can see, the red variant for this product, it's not available. It says sold out, as you can see. But it does still show here. What's the point if it's sold out? Why is it still here? <laughs> that should be like a, a default option in the settings, right? No worries. In this video, I will show you how to completely hide the, the any available variants or sold out variants for this any product, as I said, that will be automatic. So if I select this, it's gonna show the price, and but this one is still shown here. So we will keep this page open, do the trick, come back, and see it in action, reload the page, and see if this will be still here or will be not visible anymore. So let's just keep this page, and let's just get back to Shopify dashboard. After that, click on the three dots on left of customize, and click on edit code. Then after that, it will take you to the code editor for your Shopify team. And in here, we need to find the specific file. Instead of looking at the folders, you might get dizzy or something. Use the search bar and type in, again, I have to say this each time, it's gonna be either base.css, or team.css or style.css. It's gonna be one of these three. In some rare cases, some Shopify stores custom made, uh, they use custom.css. But mostly base, style, or team.css. I know it's base for me. I'm gonna type in base, and here we go, base.css. After that, scroll all the way down. Let me drag this, it's a huge file. Here we go. 
In here, we need to create some space to paste in some code. Click front of the last thing in here, then hit enter on your keyboard. We have a new line because as I said, we need to paste in some code. In order to get that code, you need to hire a developer, pay him, wait 24 hours, then he get back to you with the code, then get back to this video. I'm just joking. Scroll down the description box and you will see a link named as code. Simply click on it and it will take you to this beautiful page. And again, this code is completely free. No sh pay please, no share please, nothing like that. Just a like button, that's all I'm asking. It's actually shameful to sell some code this short, right? <laughs> this is not worth any penny. So simply select the whole code, right click and copy, then get back to our file in here and paste it at the bottom of the file. After that, click on the save button, just wait for a couple of seconds, it's good, it's saved, it. we will get back in here, reload the page and this variant, the red variant for this product should be gone. Let's just reload the page and see. And ta-da! I cannot see it anymore. As you can see, there is no more red variant for this particular product. It does not show up anymore. And that's the case for all product because this will be automatic. And that's how you hide out of stock and any valuable products, variant, sorry, on your Shopify store. And if you have any questions, make sure to drop them below. But for now, I think my job is done. So thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.